So next up is a 2005 Duramax uh, with the LLY. Um, we're gonna be putting belt on it because the belt has some cracks in it, and we'll be checking the uh, checking the pulleys. Make sure the pulleys are okay. These are really common for the either pulleys and the tensioner and pulley to start making noise on. Hopefully, since I work on this truck so much, it should be newer. I hope so. But I really don't know. No, we'll find out when we get the belts off. And these ones you can usually do. These are pretty easy to do, these belts. Just get a half inch ratchet. In the water with me. That's just topping the coolant off. Trying to get the ball to. Okay, we'll pry it back. This is one I won't need a diagram on. Just gotta be careful with the fan blade on all these diesel trucks. There's a little bit of play, there's no noise though. I'm sure I've already done these. I'm sure I did this belt a few years ago too. I've worked on this truck for the last like eight years. Yeah, you can see the cracks in it. And he's going on a long trip towing his boat, so don't definitely don't want him breaking down. Your bad belt. Let's check. That one's fine. That one's fine. Got a little plan, but that's that's completely normal. Cool, looks good and got this really nice GM belt. I wasn't expecting, but it's weird because belts are kind of one of the things that are getting harder to find out too. Certain vehicles we can't get belts for, we have to wait a day, which is just weird. But that's the way it is now, you know. Where everybody's got to wait. Nobody likes to wait. Okay. I'm hoping this is the correct size belt. This should have a 105 amp alternator on it. All these single alternator Duramaxes generally have a single amp. Or a single amp. A 105 amp alternator. From what I've seen on the diesels, at least on the LOIs and LB7s. Okay, there's that. So make sure you get it around all the pulleys. Okay, there's looks good. This is how I do these. I leave it loose on the top and then we'll get the tensioner going. Every day. I get to hear that. How do we look? It looks straight. What do you say? Mm -hmm. And uh, fucking, uh, he's all no. He's all if there's coolant in the cylinder, it's gonna get in the exhaust port. Yeah. So I was like, okay, cool. So those are pretty stouty heads. Okay, time to fire it up. Wanna make sure it's always straight. Everything looks good. 